What's up everyone, today I'm gonna teach you how to do Kipo from Kipo and the Edge of Wonder Beats. If you're new to this channel, be sure to like, subscribe and comment below. I'm gonna draw on my Wacom tablet, but you can follow my tutorials with any other media that you have, whether it's pencil color, sharpie or crayon. Now first of all, I'm gonna draw her hair, so I'm gonna take a middle point right here and draw a diagonal line to the left and up. And from the same point, I'm going to draw a line upwards. And from the middle point of that line, I'm going to draw a line to the right and out. And then I'm going to make a diagonal sharp turn up and sideways to the left. And at this point, I'm going to draw another spike the right and up and a sharp turn to the left of the head and at this point I'm gonna draw another spiky shape and sharp turn back down and another spiky shape to the left and up and sharp turn back down and from the base of that I'm gonna draw a curve line to the side and turn it downwards now from this point right here I'm gonna draw a curve line diagonally to the left and down and I'm gonna make a turn downwards and from that point I'm gonna make a sharp turn to the side and then another spiky shape with a curve line going down and sharp turn back to the side and for her ear I'm gonna make a semi-scope line right there turn it downwards and I'm gonna make a turn to the right I'm gonna trace the same outline at the upper section inside of the ear right there and a curve line at this corner now on the right side of her face I'm gonna draw from this point a curve line downwards and I'm gonna make a semicircle turn to the center of her chin right there and then I'm gonna make a turn diagonally up back to the left side of her face I'm gonna copy the same shape of the hair on the side on the right right here and a curve line for the ear now from the center of the face right here I'm gonna draw a diagonal line up and I'm gonna make a semicircle turn diagonally to the outer corner of the eye and I'm gonna draw a similar shape at the lower half of the eye right there and at the outer corner of the eye on the left I'm gonna thicken these two lines and inside the eye I'm gonna add a circle in the middle right there and on the top left of that circle a small circle and a black one in the middle on top of the eye I'm gonna trace the same shape at that corner and for her eyebrow I'm gonna draw a curved line right there on top of the eye and I'm gonna thicken the inner corner of that eyebrow so I'm gonna copy the same shape of the eye on the right
Now for her nose, I'm gonna draw a triangle shape in the middle right there. And for her mouth, I'm gonna draw a curved line at this point and below that a curved line and I'm, I'm gonna stretch the middle point downwards and up on the sides and across the curved line for her teeth right there and another curved line at this corner for her tongue now below the head I'm gonna draw a curved line down on both sides and then I'm gonna draw a curved line to the side to her shoulders make a turn down at the side right there and from the this point on the left I'm gonna draw a diagonal line across and I'm gonna make it turn sideways to the right and on the shoulder I'm gonna take this point and draw a line down and another line down at this point and on the left I'm gonna pick this point now going down to the sleeve we're gonna extend the line on the side and I'm gonna make a turn in on both sides and then I'm gonna take this point and draw a line down and flare it outwards below the waist I'm gonna do the same thing on the left side as well and then at the bottom point I'm gonna draw across the line now for her hands I'm gonna take this point below the sleeve and draw a curved line down and flare it slightly out below the elbow point and back in at the wrist I'm gonna do the same thing on the left side now for her pants I'm gonna draw a curve line below the shirt from the side down and in the middle of the legs I'm gonna draw across a curve line right there and a line down from the shirt and on the side I'm gonna draw a line down and curve it to the right but for the inner line of the legs I'm gonna take this point off center and draw a curved line down and then I'm gonna flare it out below the knee slightly and back in towards the ankle and I'm gonna do the same thing on the right side there and below that across a curved line and at the side I'm gonna add a line coming down and across another curve line below that I'm gonna draw a straight line coming down and I'm gonna make a turn at the front part of the ankle diagonally to the right and I'm gonna do the same thing for the heels right here. and I'm gonna connect those points together with the curve line now slightly above that lowest point, I'm going to trace the same shape above it. Like that. And at the front part here, I'm going to draw across a curve line. And from the top part of the shoe, I'm going to draw across a curve line and a line coming down off center in front and I'm gonna follow the same direction 
as the sidelines and another one at that side along the space in between I'm gonna draw the knots with two lines each along that space all the way to the front and we're gonna copy the same shape on the left side as well For her hands on the left, I'm gonna extend this down, down and I'm gonna make a turn at that point. And for the outer line, I'm gonna extend this line down and turn it diagonally to the right and down. And I'm gonna copy the same shape at this corner. Now for the right hands. Now for the right hand, I'm gonna draw her wrist band. So I'm gonna draw across a curved line at the lower point of the hand right there. And a line on both sides and another curved line at the lower point. And in this space, I'm gonna draw across some curve line. Now for the other wristband, I'm gonna draw across a curve line and a semicircle line at the side and I'm gonna copy that below and I'm gonna copy the same shape of the hand on the right side as well. Now for her hair behind her head, um, I'm gonna take a point at the side of her face and draw a diagonal line out, sharp turn back, in and out and in and out and back to the side of her face. That's all for our tutorial today. I hope you enjoy it and find my lessons helpful. Be sure to like and subscribe to this channel. Also, feel free to drop your requests, suggestions, or any other comments in the comment section below. See you next time.